early years of the 20th century witnessed the birth of modern intellectual movement in Sudan as different societies were formed in conjunction with cultural and art movements. Many poets, writers, and intellects cropped up to influence the march of education in Sudan to great extent. These movements were incarnation of types of art, science, and different philosophies. Being sequential and independent, they vary from region to another owing to different communities. Through modern communication revolution has accelerated disappearance of distinction leading to the intermixing of cultural attitudes and pervading of the strongest culture. Attention paid to modern culture and higher education was hallmarked by Scientific Institute in 1912 and then came Kitchener School of Medicine in 1924. This was followed by higher schools established for science, engineering, agriculture, veterinarian, and law by the end of the 30s of the last century to provide post-secondary education for the youth of Sudan. With the advent of 1945 high schools were integrated in the Gordon Memorial College and subsequently Khartoum University College was formed in addition to Ibadan, Nigeria and Makari College in Uganda. On acquiring independence in 1956, the Khartoum University College detached from London University to build its own independent management as the first national university. Sudanese Ministry of Higher Education and Scientific Research was established in 1970 and entrusted with developing policies, plans and programs of higher education and scientific research and orchestrate coordination in between institutions which consist of universities, state and private institutes, centers and institutes established under its own decree and laws and have scientific, administrative and financial autonomy and supervised by the boards and administrative organs. For years, the Ministry of Higher Education has embarked on evaluating the educational process of universities in Sudan and formed a special body that cares for quality, the adaptation of new educational programs and evaluation of the existing ones in an attempt to probe the needs for developing or modifying the course or converted to another in accordance with multinational and academic considerations. Nevertheless, the ministry began through the above mentioned body to establish quality unit in universities, all with the aim of assisting in achieving the objectives of quality unit and adaptation of the ministry current programs. Before the year 1989, higher education institutes accommodate an estimate 6% of those who sit for Sudanese certificate examination yearly for the presence of these institutes in the capital. This contributed to reduction of development opportunities in the country. Though resources of higher education were meager, its burdens on the treasury grew for increasing numbers of students were obliged to study abroad. 